Well, teachers unions across the state, including here in Bay County, are speaking out against a new law set to go into effect this summer. They say it imposes new hurdles when it comes to organizing and keeping members. And as News Channel 7's Allison Baker reports, some teachers unions are taking legal action. And I just do not understand why um, Tallahassee has felt the need to pass this law. The president of the Association of Bay County Educators is speaking out after Governor Ron DeSantis signed Senate Bill 256 into law last week. A bill the governor says is aimed to empower educators across the state. It's also something that's going to allow the, um, the state to look at how many people are joining. Uh, and if you don't have a sufficient number of joining, then that should not be the bargaining unit uh, if you don't even represent the majority of people. So, so they've changed that threshold uh, to make sure that that's the case. DeSantis says now with SB 256 in place, teacher unions will have to represent at least 60% of employees, 10% higher than it was before at 50%. Something Denise Henson, the president of the ABCE, says isn't right. It's just a way to make it more difficult for us. And as I pointed out, that if we don't reach that 60%, then we have no voice. We have been stripped of our constitutional right of, to collective bargaining at that point. And I don't see how that can happen. That's not legal. It's unconstitutional. It's just a, a way everything in this bill is just a stepping stone to take our voice away. Also, starting July 1st, unions will no longer be allowed to deduct dues directly from employees' checkbooks. But Henson says they planned ahead of time. Well, we have a system already in place because we knew that this was probably coming um, after the legislation last year. But this is just taking freedoms away. Um, I should have, I'm an adult. I know what I need to have taken out of my paycheck. Henson tells us she isn't the only one opposed to these changes. Last week, the Florida Education Association, along with three other affiliate unions, have filed a federal lawsuit against Senate Bill 256. Now a judge will have the final say. In Bay County, Allison Baker, News Channel 7. The law is set to go into effect on July 1st. We'll have a breakdown of what's in the bill on WJHG.com.